Hi. Welcome back to the Ash Hole Arena. I'm Stan Fruber with you today. We're going to witness this epic battle between two brothers separated by a decade and other mothers, of course. Chevy versus Milo, live from the Ash Hole Media Arena. Let's get this fight underway, but first, we will meet the two contenders. Chevy weighing in at 9 pounds comes from Sheridan. His nickname is Fuzzball. And then we have, of course, the reigning champion Milo, who's from Green River. His nickname is the Kang. Let's get this underway with round one. Chevy makes the first grab, and Milo responds with an illegal biting move. That's going to cost him. They seem to be weighing their options now. Someone in the audience keeps farting. Chevy jumps at Milo's inattention. He's got him where he wants him. It's a left, right, left off. A big blow. Whoa. Milo says he's boss. He's not going to take that one sitting down. Ooh. Chevy taps Milo to hold off for a second. Damn it, someone keeps farting. Hi, you two. Quit looking at the camera. Get back to fighting. Oh, Chevy's just taking advantage of Milo's inattention. Well, he just shakes it off like Taylor Swift, and that's the end of round one. Here are your round one stats brought to you by Lido Phrase. As you can see, Chevy led Milo by one point in the head jabs area, but he took a beating with the illegal biting. Both are just about tied though, eight to nine. Round two, the cats are in the same position as before. Chevy bites, oh that's gonna hurt, but Milo's quick on the response. They're taunting each other now. Chevy grabs Milo even though he weighs less. Milo files for it every time. Milo takes command, Chevy's got nowhere to go. Oh no, there he goes. Ah! Chevy fell off the cliff, but he's okay. We're right back into this one with Chevy's signature move. Milo sees it coming, but lays down to get a better foothold. There's some bunny kicks. Seriously, throw that farting guy out right there. That guy, he's sitting in row 20. He's got a megaphone on his ass. Security, get in here. Sorry about that, Milo goes for it again. Oh, the horror! Chevy taps Milo saying, knock it off. Oh, Milo almost knocks Chevy back again, but chickens out at the last minute. And that's the end of round two. As you can see, a lot more head jabs this round, but illegal biting is going to cost Milo. They're both tied at the end of round two. Still an upper hand for Chevy, though. He's got the weight difference, but he still looks good in this one. Once again, these stats are brought to you by Lido Frey's, making good chips and good food. Early start to round three, the Cats come out swinging. Chevy pounces and Milo gets ready. Oh, those biting moves for Milo are racking up. You can tell the old man's very tired, but he's taunting Chevy like no other. Some headbutts there. Walk like an Egyptian. Milo's got Chevy out. Oh, oh, that's cute. Chevy goes for the headlock and has it. You can just hear the headbutts. This is the most brutal round I've seen and I've eaten at McDonald's. Milo's biting moves cost him dearly. He may lose this. And he does. He throws in the towel after losing just three long rounds. Oh no. I'm Stan Fuber here with you from the Ash Hole Media Arena. Thanking you for joining us on Home Cine Time from the Cole Flash box office. Hope to see you next time when we take on two other fighters from two other mothers and... I have no idea what the hell I'm talking about. Just read the end credits now. Thank you for watching. Subscribe to UB Studios. Ah. Hi.